Well, Henry Cooper's nothing but a tramp. He's a bum. I'm the world's greatest. He must fall in five rounds, but if you talk about me, I'll cut it three. I'll never fight another fella as tough as Doug Jones, not even that big, ugly, bear Sonny Lister. I broke my back. What do you mean by that? You my broke back, back is broken. What, a, a vertebrae or, or well, what portion? Spinal. This, this next question, I mean, we've been debating this, y'all, for about 20 years. Um, <clears throat> in a hypothetical, who do y'all have women of? Winning of? A prime Mike Tyson, a 1987 Tyson, versus a prime Ali, like a 67 Ali. Who do y'all have winning? I go with Mike first. Uh, I got Tyson, and uh, I have Tyson because Ali Ali was was uh, a lot of attributes that we've never seen in a heavyweight, but the things that he kind of threw away. For, as far as fundamentals, is what to get him handled versus Mike. Like, when he threw that jab, he dropped his backhand every time, which is why, you know, during their fights with Ken, Ken Norton, he was like, hey, when he throws his jab, you throw your jab back. So mm -hmm. you – but you raise yours up. You catch your, you catch his jab, and while you're throwing his, yours is going to land. So he, he's out jabbing Ali. They're mystified as to why that's happening. Yeah, well, we just figured it out. Like, it, I mean, you came in the gym. You was dazzling. You was fast. But you didn't know to put your, your other hand up to, to catch a counter jab? Because for years, you have been doing it to the point where people are like, all right, well, we're going to save that for you. Mm. Which reminds me of of the uh, of how they was breaking down Trinidad. And I was like, man, every time he set his feet, I just step back. And then when he lifted up, I'm, I'm fighting with him, which is how, how Hopkins got him. For somebody to get you two or three fights where you you jab and then they, they jab back, catch your mm. jab and hit you when you don't adjust to that. Or when... Uh, Frazier was just was just ducking under his stuff with the hooks, and they're like, "Yeah, Ali was Ali was older then, but those same fundamental flaws was in him before. People just weren't fast enough to take advantage of it. Like when you were in your prime, yeah, all those flaws are there. Everything is great, but once you slow down just a tick, it's like, all right, man. Well, well, we're gonna do that, or you just meet the person that's just right for you. So the fact that Mike came up. Like, all right, man, you, you're our weapon against Larry Holmes, who was the heavyweight champion at the time when he was coming up. But Holmes was known for having an amazing jab. So, like, if, if you're training to get Holmes, you're going to get Ali. Yeah. Ali really wasn't even protecting his body at that time. And if you watch tapes of Ali at any point in his career, when he threw that jab, it, that backhand kind of dropped completely. Like, it's off the map. It's not protecting anything. Which is which is why uh, they thought Sonny Liston was going to just run through him, mm -hmm. but then Sonny Liston found out, man, if you you know you run into a hive of bees, them stings do hurt after a while. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not yeah. one or two, it's just yeah, that whole hive getting at you. He he just wasn't fast enough to catch up with him at the time. But yeah, them, them same flaws in Ali that were exploitable years down the line. I think that Mike would have been able to exploit it enough to at least slow him down. And if that body slowed down, then Mike was at your head. Yeah, and they do have a common opponent with uh, Holmes. Um, LaMarcus, who do you think? Man, I'm, I'm going with Ali, man. Is it because he likes I'm him? going with Ali. <laughs> <laughs> no, <Nah>, bro. <laughs> okay, let, 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 who do y'all think was Tyson's greatest win? And then after you answer that, his toughest win. So you so you go you going with the career argument over the skill argument. So I thought we was comparing skills, not career. No, no, no. I'm I'm tying it into skills too. Mm. It I mean Mike Mike can't compare it to Ali's resume. So I mean even if we even if we were to name that if we could name the top people that Mike beat, and I, I still be like, no, nah, you're not messing with Ali's resume. Mm -hmm. Ali's resume is one of the reasons he, I, he, I really can't fight him being labeled the greatest. If you, if you think mm -hmm. Ali is that dude, you, you can't go through his resume and try to discount his resume. It's like, like no. Nah. And then once you add his humanitarian efforts in there, I've never. Once people are like Ali's the greatest, and Mike Tyson said that himself, you can't debate that. How his resume is deep. Oh, yeah. Even yeah. after years off. I'm not saying who had the better career. I'm just saying who, 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 who do you think 
as, as, as everybody that Tyson fought, who do you think was the best person Tyson fought? Skill-wise, most probably skilled person Tyson fought. Huh? I, I think the, the best and the most accomplished was Spinks. And yeah. Mike got him out okay. of there quick. But is Spinks that, is that a body? I mean, but is that a result of Mike's? <laughs> Go ahead, Jay. Now, I was wondering, is that, a, is that a product of Mike's, the era of boxing, though? You know what I'm saying? Boxing wasn't the same when Mike was coming through as it was back when Ali was boxing. You know what I'm saying? Because you had multiple ways. You had more ways to make money around the time Mike came up. Back in Ali's day, boxing was probably one of the most higher fan things that you could do. So you That's had more competition, more people going to do it. Because if you think about it, most of the boxers in the 80s, they were they were trying to play linebacker. If you think about it, I mean, <laughs> versus in the 60s, I mean, I mean we still it's... had, you know, segregation and boxing was a, was a more attractive sport because it was a way mm -hmm. that a black person with his two fists, he can beat the odds. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there is some socioeconomic things that kind of change the competition through time. Because, I mean, you even see it in boxing now. They, I mean, they have no heavyweights. Cause they all like, man, why am I gonna get out there and get punched in the face? Mm -hmm. I can put on my helmet, go tackle yep. somebody. Yep. So do you have uh, Tyson or uh, Ali winning, Jay? Uh, I mean, if we if we going off skill, you know what I'm saying? I, I think, if you know, I don't want the Nation of Islam, Mike. You know what I'm saying? The real Mike. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That was recruiting. The real one, <laughs> custom auto Mike. You know what I'm saying? That Mike. I think I think he get Ali in a close fight just because of just because of his, his his style at the time he he was designed to fight against uh, somebody with a good jab with all his head movement getting under the jab getting inside and um Ali could be touched you know what I'm saying yeah. and so with Ali being touched I mean Ali was fast I think Ali gonna piece he gonna he gonna put some blows on Mike but that you know that Mike he was just different you know what I'm saying so I I, I don't know I think he get Ali to me. Yeah. But if I wouldn't have a problem with somebody saying Ali won, you know what I'm saying? I could see it going either way. But I think Ali being able to get touch and Mike having that combination and that power, I think he could. I think he could do it, you know what I'm saying? Because I think Tyson had more power than uh jo than uh Frazier. Who my man? Joe yeah, Frazier. Than Frazier. Frazier. Yeah, Frazier broke his jaw. I think Mike might get him out of there. Oh yeah, because because Tyson had power in both hands too. Yeah, yeah. You know, uh, Lamarcus. I, I still think I leave. I think with the jab and then the pull counters he got in his straight right, I think I think he'll get Mike up out of there. That's just me. I could be wrong. That's just now, me. Now this ain't the nation of Islam, Mike, man. You gotta go back <laughs> and look at Mike, man. I'm talking about the real Mike, man. Off the meds, Mike. You know what I'm hey, saying? I, the, the, you I, know I, I I got you the killer, the the, the warrior Mike. I, 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 yeah, I yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I I still think Ali I, I think Ali get him out of there. Yeah, yeah. and then Ali pulls straight back, not even worrying about his body. That was that was even sixty seven. That was Ali's way of dodging, man. He moved his face out the way, man. Mm -hmm. So I I think after a while, Mike hey, Mike got that high jab. Did he, he dip go low on you to load up on that right mm -hmm. hand? He he gonna start catching that boy. So I, I, but he, I don't know. I, <laughs> if but, if feet ever went on that young Ali, I just don't see it. He don't got no infighting skills. But what, you so you think Mike get inside on him? Mike will have to. If you don't, then this is it. We have oh, a if Mike fight on the outside. Yeah, if Mike fight <laughs> on the outside. It's a wrap. <laughs> <laughs> like said, yeah, man, we had, you, you, you like get in there. Nah, this is yeah, I, I think though, if he, I mean, if he can keep him at bay and just dance on him and keep the jail pumping, I think that he, I think he beats Tyson. I mean, that's just me. Yeah, like yeah. I said, I mean, Tyson get, I just, to I, get him. I just don't think he dances for fifteen rounds though. Yeah, you know they're doing fifteen. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. We see, we, we didn't say fifteen rounds. I thought we, we, we <laughs> rounds. <laughs> but would y'all agree that that Tyson would have to get him out of here? We'll get him out of there in, in the first six rounds. I mean, the, the longer the longer the fight go on, the better the favor yeah. is in Ali. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I agree with that. I mean, a point a points victory. Yeah, it 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 would probably go to Ali. But I feel like that like Mike will still be swinging for the fences, however long it went. It's really I don't I don't think either of them really changed the game plan. I I, I haven't seen that from either. Of them. Where it's like, all right, man, I came in that wasn't working, so I'm gonna do it like this. I'm gonna do it. It's like either that that main game plan worked or it didn't. 
But in Ali's case, you were such an exceptionally gifted he heavyweight as far as mm -hmm. as movement skills and how you could how you could spot things coming in. It was like, uh, but Mike, and, and like a lot of times too, Mike, they always point to the whole rope dope like, oh, you know, he he would stand, uh, he would stood uh, Foreman's, you know, punches. Uh, I'm sure he can, you know, take uh, Mike's punches. I don't think that it would have got to that point. I, I think he would have got Mike out of, no, I think Mike would have got Ali out of there within three rounds. And that's like no that hate. That, that's was like that no hate. Ali? You said what? Ali? 67, was, that was what? He was with the nation too, I think. In 67, I think we talking about what? The, the Cleveland Williams time. Yeah. When, when yeah. Ali was, was that dude. Now, I, I, he wouldn't even have did the rope dope back then. That wouldn't have came in his mind. His legs was going by the rope. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So he kind of he kind of had to do that. I mean, it, it was like, all right, man, this is this is the strategy. But he did take some some big blows. But Mike threw in combination way faster than uh than Foreman did. Even though I, I do think that Foreman had a bigger punch. Oh yeah, bigger man too. Hey, oh yeah. It, and I mean, again, Foreman ended up being real skilled. But at that time, he was just running through people so fast. Uh, well, I'm gonna run through him too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I, I think Mike's combination of speed and power and how low he stayed to the ground to take advantage of his stature it would be too much for Ali. It's it's weird when you when you punching down and then somebody catches you aiming down like leaning your weight down and they rock mm -hmm. you. It's like all right, man, it, coming up like that, it, it's a different type of blow. Yeah, 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 yeah. But so, again, I I I can't. I, I'm not gonna fall anybody that has any. It, any opinion right there because if we look at Mike's resume he does not have anybody that's like a young Ali at all no. but not many people have somebody like, like a young Ali and the people that do have a young Ali on their resume have an L next to it so yeah. it is <laughs> yeah 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 yeah